South Melbourne. Yeah, Carl, forward, Tomei, Carl again. Good pull in here, Tomei! Yes! Great goal, Norman Tomei. Olympics first attack of the game. South Melbourne look to the ground. Understandably, they've been surprised here by UTS Olympic. Leo Carl played a major part in the goal. Tome with the volley in the end that Petkovic got at least a hand to. But he couldn't keep it out. Tome's volley was sweetly struck. Wozanowski. Good quick ball forward. Leo Carl involved again. That's a great ball for Emerton. Through Brett Emerton, side netting. Marvellous work by Carl in midfield. Emerton was put through with just the goalkeeper to beat. The shot had power, but Petkovic had the near post well covered. Again, great play to admire from South Melbourne, Josephides. Players in the centre, surely a goal, an easy one as well for Paul Trimboli. Well, it had to come. And the champagne style of play that we've seen in this first half so far from South Melbourne. Well, Ogenenos, I don't know what he was doing there, but he totally gave up on chasing Josephides. It was an easy pullback and an even easier tap-in for Paul Trimboli. Josefides outpaced Ogedinos with ease there. And if Trimboli hadn't finished it off, there was Butianis waiting just behind him. 1-1. One, one. Dimitris onside. Danger here for Olympic pullback. Trimboli again off the line. Lozanowski, a goal to Goran Lozanowski. Well, the flag's up. Now, what happened here? Trimboli certainly, at the first attempt, was onside. But Matthew Breeze has gone over to his linesman. Diomitis pulled it back. Trimboli's shot was saved off the line. Now, Diomitis came back on the park here and was in an offside position as the ball went into the net. But was he interfering with play? He wasn't, according to the referee, and that is a goal. And I have to say, a good decision by the referee because Diomitis was at the far side here on the left hand side of your screen as you'll see in just a moment Trimboli's shot was saved off the line superbly Lozanowski got the angles right crowd being announced here at Belmore 5,500 approximately a bit less than their average of recent seasons. The sun certainly isn't performing as well this season as it has in the past. Mr. Dulu, great shot. Petkovic down. And hacked away at the end by Beza. Well, Michael Petkovic was woken up there by a stinging shot from Chris Dulu. Emerton's cross picked out Juric. It's still not out. Leo Carl, not much room for him to operate. He wriggles away beautifully from Lozanowski. Still Leo Carl pulling it back. Great ball. Emerson miss kicks. Cheers, Tomei. Corner to UTS Olympic. But wonderful play there by Leo Carl on the left. Well, Christodoulou was tugged back by Damianos. He shrugged it off and took the shot. Plenty of power. Petkovic did well. And Beza assisted. Damianos over the ball. Orlich forward. Mr. Dulu takes over. Nick Orlich, I'm sure, would love to find a goal from somewhere against his old team. Oh, there's a chance here. Coveney, only Catlin to beat. Great save, Bobby Catlin. Keeping Olympic very much in the game. Well, Trimboli sized up the opportunity in a flash and he played an early ball across to Coveney who had time to stop it before he took the shot but in doing so he allowed Catlin time to close him down.
Well, no one reacted in the defence, but Lozanowski did in the attack. It's a clever ball across Trimboli. Easy goal for Paul Trimboli. The flag stays down this time. Trimboli gets his second. It was a tricky chance that was made to look absolutely elementary. Trimboli with the goalkeeper to beat. Catlin was sold the dummy. And Trimboli makes the game almost safe for South Melbourne. It'll require something special for Olympic to come back now. Trimboli had an extra man to his left. He sold Catlin. And it was an easy finish in the end. Trimboli. A little dink over the top. The flag stays down. Through the centre. Easy tap in offside. Coveney clearly offside there. And it's a good decision. But South Melbourne carved open the defence. Juric missed it. Diamitis was so quick to get forward. Probably couldn't miss, but he was offside. As you can see, a number of the Sydney Olympic faithful have already left. They're disappointed. Well, there were hopes here this evening for a new beginning for Sydney Olympic. They were very high before the game, but South Melbourne had their own agenda and they quashed totally the high hopes of victory with the new consortium here.